go, folks. You raise me. You're awful cruel. The other boss was going to hear today. I said, yeah. Why you got to leave home? That's not our world. Sit down and put my clothes in my little flower sack. I hear about on the trouble with bushes. Old fool thought I was going to Sunday school and I was leaving home. Get on the bullet and get on the train. And I see the train for my life. I'm looking back at the tail of my eyes. Scared old folks going over the people and they're going to come back home. I hear the train blow like that. You roll up in the yard like this. He pull up in the yard and he got his water. He pull out. In for Glen Raven, he come and start like this. Got on up about two miles, he blow the gate. Of course, I wasn't going to the foot and rest. Got in the rain for the chain train. When you know you change train, you change whistle. You got all up the road about 10 miles, he done like that. Oh, I think it's up. I used to be good, boy, but I can't do it now. Well, I wasn't going no fun one. Well. I got him with him. Went walking on down the street. He was eyeball me. He matched a lot of little eyeballs from the middle back. I said, Bess, I'm a stranger boat in your town. Came a horse with you. She said, yes. Me and I went walking on down the street like that. Your name is Mimi Bow. I rest my hat. Thought I was gonna have a nice time. I boy, I boy, come back here. Knock on the door again. She said, Don't play that boy in the barn. I ain't do that every night. He called again. I didn't like that so hard. I looked out the window, nods I could see. Looked like he had a 44. I said, maybe the window, and maybe the door, maybe the cat. Oh, I don't know. But this man coming in his house, I'm going down. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs>